Quick Cut is the number one alternative to Huddle. First, it has better storage options. You will never delete film again. Second, Quick Cut gives you a feature-rich recruiting tool so that athletes can view all of the colleges at every level of play. Head coaches have email access to every position coach at every college. Third, their upload live feature allows every play to be uploaded to your platform just seconds after the play is over. And fourth, coaches have the option of basic stats with 14 columns of data or advanced stats with over 40 columns of data. Fifth, Quick Cut is half the price. Visit their website at quickcut.com. That's Q W I K. C-U-T dot com. Request your free trial. So, welcome to coaching school. Talk, yeah. talk to me about it. What's the best part about being here? Well, I, I think, you know, the best part, you know, is is really twofold. Number one, you know, the, uh, the camaraderie that you have with, you know, fellow coaches and, and being able to learn from fellow coaches and um, uh, all that goes with that. And and then number two, I think the Texas High School Coach Association does a great job of providing a multitude of, of lectures from all different type of topics, from X's and O's to culture development to program organization, you know, for all sports. And, uh, um, you know, it's really a comprehensive uh, convention and, uh, you know, there's really nothing else like it out there. Nice. Well, your um, new school. Talk to me about what they have coming back because they lost a lot, right? Yeah, we graduated quite a few guys uh, from the team uh, last year, but uh, we got a good core group of kids coming back. Um, uh, we're placing a lot of uh, linemen, um, you know, uh, up front on both sides of the ball. Um, but uh, we feel like we got some good kids that uh, are going to be able to step in and and uh, fill those voids, and um, you know, we got some good skill players coming back on both sides that uh, got some experience, and so. You know, it's just like any year in high school football. Um, you, know, you get you have some kids coming back, and you get some kids that graduate, and and uh, sometimes you look around, it's like, well, who's going to be, who's going to fill that void? And there's always kids that have been working really hard, and that that are going to step in and do a great job. And and I, I'm, you know, I got every confidence in the world that uh, it'll be that way this year. Nice. And uh, what do you expect out of the district? You know, kind of give us some ranking. Well, you know, this is, with me being my first year in the district. Um, you know, I'm still learning myself, but I, I know this: we we, we we play in a very tough district. Uh, you know, a lot of uh, teams that are very well coached um, in our district, and uh, there's there's no there's no gimmies, there's no easy games. Uh, you know, obviously, uh, um, you know you got uh, you know you got some up and comers like you know Iowa Colony that's now going to be a year older as a school, and those kids will be a year older. Um, you know that uh, has got you know a lot of talent, and then you got. You know Navasota, who's who's had you know tradition of success over the years, and, and they're really on the upswing. And uh, you know Bay City, and uh, you know they've done a great job there as well. And you know of course Needville's always um, you know uh, a great program. And then you know Brazos Sports going through a coaching transition, but you know a lot of uh, you know what they've been doing will be very similar. So I think uh, you know uh, Stafford obviously uh, is the other one that uh, you certainly can't forget about because of their overall athleticism, and um, so it's going to be a great it's going to be a great district, very tough as it always is, and um, you know we're, we're looking forward to it. And and I guess at the end of the year, what do you say? What do you look back and decide that was success? How do you de- determine that? Well, I, I think in high school athletics. You know, uh, success is determined a couple of ways. Obviously, the easy way is you know wins and losses, and and, and that's that's very important. We want to win them all. Um, but I think you know, d- did we did our team play um, at its maximum potential? You know, did did we give and did we get our best? And that's what our standard is: is you know just our best. We can't give any more than our best. Um, and so if, if if we have reached our best. Um, you know, then it's been a successful year. I think the other part, though, for us in El Campo, um, is is the is what have we learned through the journey? Because football is going to end, whether it's this year or next year, it's going to end soon. And uh, so, you know, what have we learned about being successful in life, and and uh, you know, the impact that we've made beyond the game, so to speak. And and I think that's a huge part of our of of whether we've been successful or not. And so. We try to be very intentional about that. 
Cool. Um, this is the lightning round. Okay. Now I'm going to say two words. You tell me which one you prefer. Okay. Offense, defense. Defense. Hunting, fishing. Fishing. Mountains, beach. Mountains, definitely. <laughs> Pass or run. Well, that's a tough one. What are they giving us? <laughs> right. We better be able to run the ball, so I'm going to say run. There you go. Sunrise or sunset? Uh, sunrise. I like it. Cake or pie? Mmm, cake. <laughs> right. And who out there, name somebody who thinks you're cool. Oh, goodness. I don't know of anybody that <laughs> thinks that I'm cool. Uh you know, I've got a, I've got a, a one-year-old granddaughter, and hopefully, maybe she thinks that I'm cool. But uh, other than that, I might be in trouble. Hey, I think you're cool. <laughs> and say, uh, finally, say anything you can in a language other than English. Hola. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Thanks a lot, Coach. <laughs> hey, you bet. Thank you. This show is brought to you by the book "All I Need to Know I Learned from My Texas High School Football Coach." A handbook of wisdom for parents, young people, and yes, even coaches. Head over to www.learnedfromcoach.com and order your copy to support sharing the stories of these great coaches and leaders. That's learnedfromcoach.com.